back to my latest video. Uh, you've probably noticed by now that this is not Lords. This is actually another game I started to play. It's called Iron Throne. It's a Lords-like game, so it's kind of the same style. Um, obviously, the graphics are a little more updated and all that, but uh, I've been enjoying this game lately. Uh, I'll basically kind of go over what it's about. It's, it's very similar to the same kind of game style. There's some different things in it that uh, kind of kind of basically change the gameplay and all that, but uh, the first kind of thing is basically your castle is very similar. You have your resource things, you have your uh, training grounds and stuff where you can build troops. Um, unlike lords, you actually build different types of troops at the same time. So let's say if I wanted to build uh, like some infantry, um, I can build infantry at the same time as let's say if I wanted to build uh, my range. So um, you're, you're not stuck to building one type of troop at the same time. You can actually build all four. Um, so it's the same actual uh, kind of triangle set up there. Uh, you get your infantry, you got your range, you got your cav, and you got your siege. Um, the only difference is is, is uh, kind of how they attack each other. Um, I'll kind of show you that in one of their little mini games they have, which is actually a really fun mini game that I found out. Um, I actually almost enjoy it more than, let's say, the Lord's kind of, uh, what's it called, those... Uh, hero battles or whatever I can't, I can't I can never remember the name but basically here I'll, I'll go into one and kind of show you what it is um so basically in this kind of one it's more of a little mini game so you can have uh you can have what's called up to 10 troop types so you can let's say you choose 10 different squads so you this is this is not how like the pvp combat is or it is how pvp but not the like the castle combat i'll show you that later but um this is just kind of a little mini game but i actually really enjoy this mini game it's it's more of a little strategy mini game inside the game which i've been having a lot of fun with um so the triangle is a little different and you'll kind of see that when i go in here so i'll start the battle um so you can actually you actually have your grid so this is kind of um i don't know if you ever saw those old lords uh commercials where they had like oh you can choose your your battleground and you can change your um, let's call it squads up mid uh, battle and all that. This is exactly what it is. Um, so the other uh, other team, you can kind of see where how they've set up where their uh, thing. So I can actually move my uh, move my uh, squads around like this, and um, um, basically the, the triangle up here is uh, kind of like the same as the large triangle, where uh, but it's different because infantry is actually strong against cav, which is throw. It's been really throwing me off when I'm playing this game because. Obviously, it's the other way around where uh, infantry is good against range, but this one range is good against infantry, and infantry is good against cav, and cav is good against range. And siege is actually has no um, bonus, but it also has no like negative. Whereas in siege and lords, it's negative against all of them, and it's only good against walls. And this siege is actually just like the same as let's say if infantry went against infantry. There's no there's no bonus, but there's no drawback either. Um, so. You like to keep your siege in the back anyways because it, it can attack all units. And actually, um, I think the cav target siege first. So you'll see that in this. Um, so if you want to say, let's say, your infantry is good against range. So you actually want to put your range up in the front here because their infantry is going to run at you. And you want to keep your cav away from the infantry. So you, um, since they have all their infantry in the middle here, what I'm going to do is actually move my, uh, um, it's called cav behind my infantry here. And then basically I'll start the battle. So um, you can have the uh, battle animations on, but I use them mm -hmm. off because after the first couple times of seeing them, um, you don't actually need them. But yeah, this is kind of what's going on. So now the troops are all over the battlefield. You also have your mm -hmm. little powers, so you can actually like attack people doing it. Um, yeah. So and then you can see their their cab dest mm -hmm. destroyed my um, siege because they literally just target it first. So. Um, if they have a lot of cav, it's a good way to get the cav out of the fight because they'll just run and attack your siege right away. So that's kind of that's kind of what this is. So I'll, I'll show you the rest of the game too, but that was just a quick kind of thing there. The arena battles is very similar to this actually, so the other team will also have the same thing. So the arena is a little different than, let's say, in Lords where you have your, your heroes fighting. This is you actually have armies and you set up your different squad patterns and all that, and you can counter armies and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, so building stuff is the same. You, you have your... your um, your talents and your let's say your speed up so construction speed or your battle talents if you want but i'm on i'm, I'm just starting the account so I, I still have construction speed and all and research speed because i'm building up the account i literally just started this account a couple days ago um the world actually just opened a couple days ago too so that's why i decided i was going to do this video because the main part about this video 
is I want you guys to come join me in uh, this world. If you want to, want to just come play with me with this game, um, I'll be starting a guild, or I've already started a guild. Um, it's called uh, Duck Hunters. Um, I am My name is Duck Hunter GA for like gaming. Um, but yeah, so I, I've got 50 slots open in my guild. If you guys want to come join and come play with me, it's uh, just come do that. And uh, I, I'll basically, it'll be open up for anyone who uh, is on my channel. So I've, it's actually a uh, closed guild right now, but that's just because I don't want random people joining the guild. I want actual people who watch me play like watch my channel if they want to come play with me in this game uh this does not mean i'm quitting lord so don't worry about that i still have all my trapping i'll be doing that too but this is just something i want to do on the side i'm actually going to just build kind of a an attacking account and we can basically go attack the wonders because there are wonders so if you look at the uh thing so there are there's wonders here like these things um i guess they're called something different um but yeah you can you can take take them over uh you you can attack castles, so it's the same thing. I'm actually still in a shield because we just started. I haven't actually attacked anyone. I, I tried this out on a different account, but since a new world opened up, I was like, oh, I'm going to make a new account there. So I made a new account in this world, and I've been quickly building this up um, basically as fast as I can. So, But yes, you could attack someone, and I'm not going to do it because it's going to remove my shield. But yes, um, you, it's basically just like lords. There's resource tiles. There's monsters you can hunt as well, so... You, you can hunt the, the monster hunting is a little different because uh um either you beat the monster or you don't beat it you don't have to attack it multiple times it's basically you either can beat it or you can't so that's another way and it's very easy to get items and stuff because you you basically look at the thing and it'll actually just drop a, like literally drop an item for you so um you basically can build up very quickly a lot faster than you would be able to in the lord's mobile so that's why it's a lot really easy to get into the game really fast so it's a, well, at least I've been enjoying it a lot. So, um, like I said, I, I have a guild that you guys can join. Um, I'm going to leave a, uh, a link down in, in the description below. You can click on the link and that will bring you to the game. Um, you just download the game and, uh, if you already have the game, just let me know. And, uh, I think, I think I get a referral bonus or something for a guild. So, uh, just, just make sure that you click the link or just tell me that you have it already and I can just basically input your uh, player ID and then that'd be awesome. So I hope you guys uh, want to come play with me. If not, uh, that's totally fine. You can totally ignore this video if you don't want to play the game. Um, I will have more Lords videos coming up this week. I have another one coming out tomorrow. I just might be adding one or two of these videos just, just kind of like, like a supplementary thing. So I'm not going to make any less Lords videos. I'm just going to maybe add one or two of these videos into the thing because i'm I, it's a like my channel is a gaming channel that's kind of what i started out as i've just ma been making lords but i've started to play this game so i might add some other videos in there if you don't if you don't like them just don't watch them <laughs> um but if you do like them yeah just just like the video um you can comment down below uh if you played this game before if you like the game or whatever because i've been having some fun i haven't gotten to the late game in here but the early game is really really fun and if you guys want to come join me and uh basically take over the world together we can we can do that so i hope you guys like this and i'll see you guys tomorrow